Well, the flood watch is in effect for parts of our viewing area until tomorrow morning. With temperatures rising, the shrinking snow will release a large amount of water that could lead to flooding here in the valley. The Mahoning River in Levittsburg is currently less than three feet deep, but it's expected to rise nearly nine feet in the next 36 hours with a projected crest at 11.7 feet. That's nearly two feet above flood stage. 27 First News reporter Jeff Lef Coolidge has the latest. As the snow and ice melt, massive puddles of water begin to form on the streets in Levittsburg. It's a minor problem, but a possible sign of bigger flooding issues ahead for the massive Mahoning River, which sits nearby. Yeah, I'd be worried with all the snow and the rain that's nonstop. Teresa Clifford tells me she is still recovering from the flood this past summer, where she lost everything. There was so much water that day that her dogs had to be rescued, but it taught her how to prepare for the next flood. We have a, a tree marked in the, down a little bit lower, and as it comes closer to that, that's when we know to start moving everything. Once the river gets up to about 13 feet, then we start getting a little uh, proactive and, and taking some uh, steps to possibly, you know, warn the people and do some evacuation. Chief Ken Schick says floodwaters can be even more dangerous during the winter than the summer months since hypothermia can set in immediately if you get caught up in the water. In Levittsburg, I'm Trumbull County Bureau Chief Jeff Lefkowitz, WKBN 27 First News.